God, did that feel good or what? Well, here we are. It's been almost a year, and I am back, back on YouTube, back doing, uh, back to doing content. And I'm not gonna lie, I have missed it. I've missed it since the very beginning. Ever since I stopped doing YouTube, stopped doing content, I've missed it, and I'm just glad to be back. Glad to be dishing out content once again. And what can I say? I'm excited. Uh, anyways, welcome to the new channel. I am Fitted Insider. Hope everybody's doing well. Anyways, wasn't 2021 a trip? Just for has themselves, especially for myself. Uh, but speaking of 2021, hopefully I did this right. Uh, you'll be able to check out my top 10 on the year of 2021. I know it's been late, right? It's 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 been late. But I tried to post it on Instagram and it wasn't working for some reason. So here you go. You guys get to see my top 10. So if you guys agree with it, disagree with it, out of my top 10 along with my honorable mention, just leave some comments down below. We can we can chit chat. Anyways, 2021 was crazy. I took a break because of family reasons. My second daughter or my my new baby was born back in June. So the reason why I took so much time off is that I just needed to get ready to have another kid, a, a, a second baby on the way, and just focus on the family stuff. Because in all reality, that's what counts, that's what matters the most, is your family, your friends, your loved ones, especially over all this hat stuff. Don't get me wrong, you know, they can be pretty cool, but not as great as your family. So 2021 was really crazy just like i said stuck to the family thing and it's been absolutely beautiful but enough time has passed and i am back so think about this as like a little introduction video again to the new channel but 2021 was crazy lots of really really good hats from tons of different retailers now some retailers got better throughout the year some you know it, it kind of went back and forth it was kind of it was definitely kind of a wrestle, kind of a kind of a wrestling match, if you will. And I think it's only going to get better, especially with 2022. More retailers are taking it even more serious. So this year is going to be crazy. Now, I get it. There's been a, uh, a little halt in production uh, for the past several months. But from what I hear, it's starting to pick up again. So hopefully we can see some good hats here soon um, instead of being all sporadic. Hopefully we can just everything get in at one time you know what i mean why not anyways so yeah uh back on this new channel um of course unboxings are still going to be relevant but not nearly as much because having another kid i've slowed down significantly on buying hats once again it's uh the important things in life right so i had to cut back so unboxings are going to be slowing down but I'm planning on doing more of a critiquing process through the retailers that drop certain collections or certain hats throughout the week and multiple of other things. And don't worry, Straight Cap will be on as usual here and there. So if you guys are sick and tired of seeing me, you guys will be able to see him too. So that's that. And I'm just back to have fun, y'all. I'm just back to have fun. Uh, my previous channel, my first channel... Uh, to be honest, I a lot of those hats in those videos, I don't own anymore. I ended up selling them. At, at some point, I decided to ask myself, how many pink bottom hats or how many icy UV hats do I really need in my collection? Um, so with that being said, that was kind of primarily the main thing on my other channel, my, my, my main content. Um, but now... I definitely switched up my criteria of hats. If you guys saw my intro, I primarily, primarily just collect Twins, Diamondbacks, Angels, and I'm starting to get on with Blue Jays. Those are the four primary squads that I'm going to go after because I just love their logos and what they can do just with the overall designs. So, you know, before I used to go after this, after that, after this, or after that, but now, uh, since I slowed down enough with the buying, I just figured I needed to narrow stuff down a little bit so it at least makes sense for me. So that's the way my collection is going. But don't get me wrong, if there are certain grails or certain hats that I like uh, that end up being in the collection or that end up buying, then they have to be pretty damn special to make it since I've cut down to those four teams. So that is that. So yeah, 
Um, and also with the uh, with the previous channel and how many subs I have, if I have to work up my sub count, uh, my viewership, this and that, the likes, then so be it. I don't I don't really care. I'm just here to come back, have some fun, kick some ass, and that's all it's really about. So that is it, you guys. This was my in introduction video, and I hope you guys enjoy. Here in a couple days, I will be unboxing the couple hats I got from the Great Outdoors collection. And on top of that, I'm going to do some critiquing of, I think, the best hats from that collection, uh, the worst hats from that collection, and the sleepers. Um, so that'll be coming up soon. But that's all I got for you guys. Welcome to the introduction to my new channel. Um, yeah, that's all I got for now, you guys. Anyways, as usual, you can find me on Instagram, at Fitted Insider. Leave this video a like, comment, and subscribe. See you later.